do you guys ever catch shit for wasting food on Epic Meal Time? Like, yeah. I'm sure that's probably yeah. the biggest criticism people say about the show. Uh, yeah, well, there's lots of there's lots of criticisms. One that's consistent that comes up is, do you guys eat all this? And it's like it's a multi tiered question answer. Uh, there are times where we've food has been contaminated, and we've thrown out an uncomfortable amount of food where we've mm-hmm. been like, oh. I'm like, we're like, that's, and we do, we're like, that sucks, you know? And we're like, what would, is what it could salvageable? You do it? Otherwise. But it's just, you know, that sometimes, other times, we're like, we're five guys on camera, and there's about eight people off camera. Okay. Mm-hmm. And people on set, like, are ready. They're when always it's like, hungry. You're there, like, filming for six hours. They're ready. Like, they want to eat it. People want to try it. Mm-hmm. You know, um, we, uh, we, there were episodes where we knew there was going to be a big waste. Mm-hmm. Like, one time we put, uh, we stuffed, um, 50 birds into 10 pigs and attached all the pigs ass right. to mouth. We did yeah. it years ago and I just knew that it wasn't going to get eaten and we literally ate like two of the pigs mm-hmm. and the other eight, we had set it up with a soup kitchen in advance. Mm. They came with like garbage bags, literally scooped it all wow. in garbage wow. bags. I was like, what's it going to be? And they were like soup for a year. Whoa. So I was like, okay, really? that's cool. Did we did it. We did our TV show. We did, uh, we did, uh, donated a portion of the budget to feedingamerica.org. Right. But a lot of people are like, yo, why don't you go give that to, uh, like homeless people on the streets? And it's like, you actually can't. Yeah. It's illegal. It's yeah. Right. Like it's, it's like, you just expose yourself. Huh, really? If you're not. If you're like a production company, not illegal, that doesn't but mean, it's a liability. Yeah, it doesn't yeah. mean you could feed people. You can't feed someone, and if someone because gets sick, like you don't have insurance you? for that. You're screwed oh. for that. Some guy's really? just gonna be like, "I puked," and so I'm suing you for poisoning wow. me. Yeah, God, exactly. This is America. This is even even like if you go look at grocery stores, where like a lot of the times when we're doing meat heavy episodes, we're buying meat that's getting ex- that's going to be expired anyways. We mm-hmm. go there whenever there's stuff on sale, like expired meats. It's like one more day. We go and we buy all those up. Those get thrown out. A lot of the stuff that we use would have gotten thrown out. And you know, if you ever watch the grocery store, what they'll do is they'll like triple, quadruple bag things, and lock the dumpster in the back. Because they could throw something out, and someone can go in the dumpster, eat it, get sick, and then also sue. God bless so, America. So, yeah. I actually really do love America. God bless America. I am Canadian, and I really love this place. Every time I come here, I'm like, I love this country. <laughs> you, you used to live here when you yeah, were Yeah, I lived in Montreal. Years, yeah. Now you're back in Canada. I right? lived here for two years, and now I'm back in Canada, and I, I come here for work very often. Mm-hmm. Uh, Where do you guys film from now? Toronto. So can you can you get rid of the food there? It's not a Sioux happy there, right? No, you, it's still the same scenario. Like you, uh, huh. like you can get in trouble because we're we are a company, so you can't be giving food. You out. don't like you want can't any feed, liability. Exactly, you can't feed someone. You could, <laughs> you know, you can get in a lot of shit for that. You know what I mean? If someone starts barfing, they go to the hospital, and like shit goes down, and it's really yeah. expensive. Mm. Like that's that's on us. You know, what I, I don't mean? really understand that criticism though, as if like somehow this one large meal you made is going to solve world hunger. Well, the biggest thing is, like, I noticed the people are always like, oh, look at that waste. And you know what? Everyone wastes. Yeah. But before Epic before Epic Mealtime happened, I never did anything. I didn't do anything, like, for the homeless or anything like that. And mm. the episodes where we've gone to soup kitchens and volunteered and stuff like that, or if we donated, the most I've done is during this time on Epic Mealtime. Like, it kind of like the guilt aspect of it, because mm-hmm. there was some inspired me to do something mm. but then the people that go and come and they're like oh wow look at this guy i'm like motherfucker i hope you volunteer right i hope you're a volunteer you over here right now talking shit right. about this because <laughs> right. if you're just some asshole that's you know like oh man look at this guy wasting food and it's like, well you're on you're on the internet like i'm throwing like half eaten carl's jr burger in the garbage <laughs> no they yeah. never finish their carl's jr no you know that <laughs> yeah and also i feel like i feel like at the same time it's like uh you know, if you were to overly scrutinize so many things, you really can't. I could be like, well, look at you paying for internet when people are starving. <laughs> yeah. You should How cancel dare your, you? I, you cancel your internet and, right. and we, you could we, feed uh, children for a year. We live in America. It's the most opulent. Is that the right word? Opulent, most overabundantly resourced country that's ever existed. I don't even think it's just it's like the way it's it's messed up because, as you were saying, grocery stores are even throwing out their shit. Like, whatever you guys are doing for entertainment purposes isn't the problem. When grocery stores and restaurants are throwing out Every pounds day. of food. Well, what, what I heard is that, and, uh, you know, this is something I heard, is that we have enough food on the planet yeah. to feed the planet. Right. It's just a logistics issue. Right. Like, if we can somehow move the corn <laughs> in this country mm-hmm. around the world at, right. you know, 
Basically, the thing that we need to solve world hunger is teleporters. That's where we're at. We <laughs> figure out teleportation. We can teleport I wonder all the corn to Africa. Things are good. There would be, some. as I understand it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's that simple, you guys. <laughs>